Hello guys, today I want to showcase another new Laravel feature that was released in minor version Laravel 11.23 recently, new one helper by Dan Matthews. And this is a result of discussion between himself and Josh on Twitter. So I will link the pull request in the description below and you can see and read all the context. But basically it's this, blade directive when or helper when to avoid writing if statements. And in this case, it was particularly useful for adding wire poll to live wire component, but potentially it can replace any condition. So Laravel has blade directives like add checked, add required, add selected for dropdowns, but this is a more global when. And there were quite a few comments and discussions how exactly should syntax work with all the use cases and you can read that in full again. And the final syntax result is something like this. And we tried it out with my colleague Narius created a live wire project and I will demonstrate. In the code we have a button to create a server which under the hood in live wire component creates a server model and batches the jobs to create something around those servers. This is kind of a fake example but mimics the reality of the situation. So you need to create the server, install nginx, install database and each of those jobs under the hood is actually just sleep for a few seconds so we don't do actually anything with the servers, it's just for demonstration. But then after those jobs are finished then we upload update the server with provisioned at now. And then while the jobs are in the queue, we redirect to servers show, which is another live wire component, which has render method. And that show server has that one condition that I've been talking about. So we have a div with wire poll update progress. And that update progress is the method which just refreshes the model from the database. And it keeps refreshing that model every second by default wire poll until that condition is met. And that condition is changed in the job batch after everything is finished. Let me demonstrate. First, we need to run queue listen to listen for those jobs as they are dispatched. For now, nothing in the queue, but now we click that button and see what happens. There's update every second should be with wire poll. Then in the background, we have create server with four seconds, install nginx and stuff like that. And then it is keeping one second update every second wire poll. It can be configurable to be every five seconds or every three seconds and see two things here. First, server created successfully the message and this is in the div server is being created or server created successfully. This is another div block which becomes visible but then also this condition is different and then wire poll stops updating the progress. As you can see there were 14 requests and it stopped. No more updates every second. So this is just one practical example with Livewire how to use that when helper. But you may come up with your own examples with or without Livewire. We can discuss that in the comments. What would you use this helper for? Or you don't really like it. And speaking of Livewire, if you haven't really tried it much on Laravel daily courses, I have a course so we can search for Livewire. There's Livewire 3 from scratch. It's one of the most popular courses on Laravel daily. I will link that one in the description below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.